Hi, my name is Emma Spears and I go to Lake Sumter State College. Today we're going to not only be grieving, but celebra celebrating the great life of Derek Shepard. Well, who was Derek Shepard? He was a neurosurgeon that worked at Seattle Grace Hospital on a show called Grey's Anatomy, which a lot of people have seen. He played a very iconic character that lived on for about 10 seasons. At the end of the day, he really loved his patients. He really worked for the patient's family and the patients to better them to save their lives, to better improve the quality in their life. Maybe they couldn't walk, maybe they had spinal issues, or maybe they had a tumor that could kill them, but he saved them. He always said the quote, it's a beautiful day to save lives before every surgery. This made the surgical nurses, the other doctors or interns around him feel really safe in what he was going to do. Even if he made mistakes during the surgery, he was gonna try his very best to save the patient. He saved so many lives. He did a lot of life changing surgery. Some of the most major ones was he did an Alzheimer's trial. He lost a lot of patients, but he ended up um, kind of manufacturing a new medicine that helped Alzheimer's patients. And he also helped his uh, wife's uh, mother who had early onset, onset Alzheimer's, which basically means you get Alzheimer's in your like 40s or 50s, which most people get it when they're 70 or 80. It's like earlier, so it's, it's pretty rare, but that does happen. He also worked for the president about a year before his death. He decided he wanted to work on the president's medical team. He decided to come back for his family, though. He also operated on several co-workers and family members, which really showed how he was an all-around human, but he also tried to be a good guy at the end of the day. What really kind of showed that he had a big heart was the love for his family. He met his wife, Meredith Gray. They met when they didn't know each other. They had never seen each other. They met at a bar the day before she was going to start her internship. Her name was Meredith Gray, and her mother was Ellis Gray, a famous surgeon. So they met. They went on a date. It went really great. And then she walked into the hospital and realized that he was her boss, which caused some problems, and that he was indeed married. He was in a failing mar marriage, but he was still married. So they didn't talk for a while. He was still there for her, of course, with her mother's diagnosis of Alzheimer's and several other things. But... Years later, they came back together to end up marrying each other. They also adopted a child named Zola. Zola had a lot of brain injuries, and she also, her family kind of gave up to her, gave up on her, and she kind of had a, she needed brain surgery, basically. So Derek came in, did the brain surgery, then months later, they ended up adopting this girl. They also had two other kids together, who were their biological kids, but they loved them all the same. It really showed how Derek Shepard strived to be a great father, even if he didn't do the best in certain situations, at the end of the day, he wanted to try his very best to be the best father he could. Overall, he had a great impact on the, li on the lives around him and tried his very best to be a good person. He tried his best for his family and his patients, which showed his two great passions in his life, neurosurgery and his family. He was a human just as everyone else, but he really did a lot of life-changing things, and he worked through so many things for his family and the patients around him. This shows the overall impact that Derek had as both a neurosurgeon and a husband and father. He will always be missed.